After this, I'm changing my clothes. I gotta take a shower. There's solder, there's rose. No, I Kiss my wife and my girlfriend too. I'm Her so happy. Left to go. It'll be 12 she said, time. I know you're a good woman. Car brings the trucks across the start finish line. Place your bets now. Is this the last what caution, happened? do you think? Did Did somebody somebody more caution. Come out before we get to the conclusion of the world of Westgate 200 at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Tremendous racing so far tonight. This track has produced. These drivers have produced. Veteran Johnny Sauter has produced. He's in this round of eight. He wants to make sure he makes it into the round of six. like the number eight, John Hunter down there. Also, Maya Sutter, number 13, is down there. Getting one done. Boy, Rover go four one he did. He's able to bring it around and finally get it to his pit stall. Safety crews doing a great job tonight, keeping everything looking good. Debris off the track, keeping the... Las Vegas Motor Speedway running smooth for this NASCAR Camping World Truck Series race. Get it all, Ryan. Get it all. Through a great sponsor, World of Westgate 200 here at Las Vegas here they Motor come, Speedway. Baby. 
for tonight's NASCAR Camping World Truck Series. Stuart Friesen once again in the 52 makes his way by. You hear the jet dryer screaming. He's got it, he's got it. Oh look, here they come, baby, here they come. left to go. You're making your way into the round of six for the championship. They won it. They won it bad. And we're going to see how this plays out. Here we go. Out of your seats. It'll be ten to go when they come past the flag stand this time. We'll find out if it's going to be our last
again, brings out the caution. 52. Stewart Friesen in that number 52 brings out the caution. Well, if you place your bet for a caution to come out, you've won that bet. Brett Moffitt was your race leader. Johnny Sauter had him in the cross. But with this caution back out, the field bunched up once again. And we are set up for what's going to prove to be an amazing finish for the World Westgate 200 NASCAR Camping World Truck Series race. It's coming out of two laps. Here in Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Wow, what a night this has been. Show it off. They had three, they had three cars. And I keep saying it, it's only coming the first race. We had the K&N on the dirt track last night. We got the Camping World Truck Series here tonight. Right. NASCAR Xfinity Series tomorrow, the DC Solar 300 on Sunday, the South Point 400 Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series. again in that number 52. Matt 
Camping World Truck Series. Is your water, Ryan? Yeah. It's These good. drivers are racing so hard. So the caution out once again. That is the number two of Cody Coughlin. Looks like he's got some damage on the rear of his truck. Tires being changed. And the field bunches up once again. Brett Moffitt was able to get out and jump out to a quick lead. Johnny Sauter fell back into that fourth position as Matt Crampton was hey, starting to get up on the bumper of Brett Moffitt. Caution hey, came out. Angie Josh don't kiss on the mouth. I do. That's my boy. Uh, Luca Line does, and you know what he did? Corbin Forrester Mommy, I kissed you on the mouth. For oh, that's a restart okay. violation. That's not weird. You see Crampton really up on the bumper of Brett Moffitt there. See it all, baby? Come on, Johnny, get us Been fighting all night. At Las Vegas, uh, Brett's uh, first start was earlier this season. He started in the sixth position, ended up finishing in third. Will Brett Moffitt finish first? Will he visit Woo! victory lane? Or are we going to get a veteran like Matt Crafton or Johnny Sauter in there? Grant Edfinger fights in that number 98. Oh, all these drivers hungry to make their way into that round of six. So important that they do it now. An opportunity might not present themselves. Present itself like they will to these drivers again. Are you fucking kidding me? Not funny. Get the one to go. From the flag stand, this time by Stuart Friesen in that 52. Well, recent caution. I should say the caution prior to this caution. <laughs> Losing track of my caution. Oh. Was it cold? Mm -hmm. One to go. One, two, go. Outside, Matt Crafton on the inside. I hear the crowd cheering, and rightfully so. Here we go again, fans of Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Let's see if we can get the world of Westgate 200 to a conclusion. All your feet, cheer them on. 21! 21! Oh! 
pushing all the chips on the table. Here comes Brett Moffat out of turn number four. stretch are brought to a stop as everything is cleaned up and taken care of here on the front stretch. Boy, Brett Moffat had a great jump. Jumped out front right off the bat. Almost seemed that possibly uh, Matt Crafton wow. in front of the tires didn't get the uh, restart that he wanted. Grant Enfinger was able to take advantage of that in that number 98 Ford. Yeah. So we're now a little over two hours into this race here at the Las Vegas Motor Speedway, the world of Westgate 200. You are getting your dollars worth tonight. Red flag being displayed. That's going to halt the field on the back stretch. 11 cautions have come out tonight here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Wow. FYI, the most cautions is 12 set back in 2008. Not sure if we should root for that to tie a record, beat a record, but the most cautions back in 2008 with 12 cautions. We're on caution 11 right now. 20 different lead changes as we've gone throughout the evening. Nine leaders in all. Brett Moffitt currently scored in the first position as some quick drive put down on the track. You can see exactly the tracks that the cars went. Through the grass and back onto the track. I'm gonna fucking the knock, gonna I'm gonna their knock fucking Zach out when I work cut out for him to make sure the track is good and clean as the O2 truck being hooked up to the record. For what? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. That's Austin Hill. I'm gonna go knock this fucking clock off. In the O2. Good luck. I'm gonna fucking knock him the fuck out. May the odds be ever in your favor. I'm yes. gonna knock him the fuck out. I will not stop this. Neither will I. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna knock that motherfucking wow. pussy out. Cleanup continues. No plugs in my ears. <laughs> as our 11th caution comes out here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Previous winners here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway will run tonight only include two drivers, Johnny Sauter and Ben Rhodes. Johnny Sauter went back in 2009. Ben Rhodes won in 2017 just last year. So those two drivers could be the only repeat winners we see here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Hey, look at you, Tim Hall! 
Looking at our schedule as we get into tomorrow as cleanup continues. The gate's going to be opening at 10 o'clock tomorrow at 11.05. The South Point 400 first practice is going to be happening. Don't fuck us From noon to 12.45. Actually, uh, give me a, a second here. I'm shifting my papers and we're going to move on to Saturday, actually, believe it or not. Gate's going to open at 8 o'clock tomorrow. 10 o'clock, the South Point 400 second practice is going to be taking place. 11-10. Ryan, we got qualified. So for a second. The NASCAR Xfinity so Series, the DC Solar 300, going to be taking place tomorrow. That's going to happen at 11-10. 12-30, the South Point 400 final practice is going to be happening for the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series. At 2 o'clock, we go racing with the NASCAR Xfinity Series DC Solar 300. Those drivers going to have our work cut out for them to put on a show like this that we've seen as the trucks are parked right now on the backstretch here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. They missed the whole fucking race unless they got fucking down here. Under red flag conditions. Over two hours into this race here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Red flag is out. Fastest lap of the night, 178.465 miles per hour. As I told you earlier, we got 20 lead changes, nine different leaders, and of course, 11 cautions. We were joking earlier at the start of the race if we'd even see two cautions come out tonight because two cautions was the fewest in track history. Well, now we're up at 11 and the most cautions to ever come out, 12 cautions back in 2008 as the field is halted on the back stretch. As cleanup continues, track has been so, busy tonight. What exactly is busy going on? Making sure that everything is ready to go. <coughs> Why are they all the stopped? Making their way down pit road. Let's sit on the other side adjusted so you can see everything. Making sure everything cleaned up there. Numerous trucks involved in that last incident. A lot of fenders, I'm sure, pushed in. Maybe some tire rubbing. But with just a few laps left to go, again, you let the chips lie where they fall where they may. Because you're only going to have one opportunity if you're in this position, especially if you're in the playoffs in the round of eight. Told you through the night in the round of eight, Johnny Sauter, Brett Moffitt, Noah Grantson, Ben Rhodes, Stuart Friesen, who's had an unfortunate night, Grant Enfinger in that number 98, Matt Crafton in the 88 in battling hard, Justin Haley, he's been up there battling, but he is in the round of six. <coughs> As it is playoff weekend, kicking it off here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. For the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series, South Point 400, Sunday at noon, 267 laps, 400.5 miles, going to be run on Sunday. We're so glad you're spending your weekend with us here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. <laughs> the trucks remain under a red flag, and the trucks remain parked on the back stretch. Everyone anxious to see how this is gonna conclude. Yeah, no fucking reason. Just, I'm gonna knock that motherfucker out. I am fucking mad. I am so mad right now. I'm ready to drive back King right now. I know. I am so fucking mad. Hear the jet dryers firing up. Maybe get some of the speedy dry off the track. Get things and uh, the debris cleared out. I am so fucking mad. I say just let it race. Speedy jet dryers. Under red flag conditions here at hey, Las Vegas thing, Motor man. Speedway. Great shot right there on the ISM vision screen of all the trucks parked, waiting, tough for a driver to be in this position. 
not only tough on the trucks, you know, the tires now have cooled down, but the drivers had that adrenaline going. Now they're sitting, they're waiting, they're thinking, maybe overthinking about what they've already done, thinking about what they need to do once we get to green flag racing once again. This is tough on a driver to be in this position and wait. Patience is a virtue, even at uh, 170 some miles per hour. The distinctive sound of the jet dryers here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Cleanup continues on the track, also on pit road. Who's going to visit Victory Lane tonight? We'll get there. The question is, who is it going to be? Here's how the field is set up right now. Brett Moff has shown first, Grant Infinger second, Justin Haley third, Johnny Sauter fourth, Ben Rose fifth, Matt Crafton shows sixth, Myers Schneider seventh, Ross Chastain eighth, Chris Eggleston ninth, Austin Lane South is tenth. Jesse Little, 18th, and DJ Bell, John Hanavita, check in 20th position. Timothy Peters, 21st, uh, 21st, Austin Hill, 22nd, followed by Noah Gregson. Difficult night for him, starting on the pole. Cody Coughlin, 24th, Corey Roper, 25th, then Brandon Jones, Todd Gilliland, 27th. Wendell Chavis is 28th, Riley Herbst, 29th, Bo Lamast is 30th, Joe Nemechek, 31st. Tanner Thorson scored in that 32nd position. We hold under red flag conditions here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Waiting to go back to green. What a wild ride it's been for the World of Westgate 200 NASCAR Camping World Truck Series fans up front. Making sure they've got a great view of the action. Once we get started again. <coughs> Looks like we're getting close. It's a great job by the track crew tonight. Safety crew doing an amazing job. Keeping the track safe. Round of applause for them. Hopefully we're getting close to putting that red flag away. We'll get back under yellow flag condition to get the field rolling once again. And there's a reason to cheer. The yellow flag is being waved again here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. The jet dryer is blowing some of that speedy dry still off the track. Looks like all the trucks are starting to roll. Everyone was able to refire. Equipment now. Tires have cooled down. They're going to see these trucks try and warm them up. Mentally, what did I do last time that I didn't like? Did I spin the tires? Did I choose the wrong line? What do I need to do this time to make sure that I have an opportunity to make my way into victory lane? We're not just talking about Brett Moffitt and Brett Hinton in that first, second spot. But what we're seeing here, we've seen the first go three, four wide at any given occasion. Back than that. Crazy things that happened here tonight at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. And we'll see if we're done with that craziness. There's Brett Moffitt, Grant Infinger, Justin Haley, Johnny Sauter, Ben Rhodes, Matt Crafton. Any of those drivers have an opportunity. Right in the midst of it. And a win would be big for Johnny Sauter or Brett Moffitt. Ben Rhodes. Matt Crafton. 
inducted in the number 88, the two veterans of Matt Crafton and Johnny Sauter. That's been fun to watch tonight. Here, Justin Haley, Johnny Sauter back in that third, fourth position, Ben Rhodes, and Matt Kraft in five and six. Here we go. Are we going to do it this time? Yell, scream, cheer, clap, jump up and down. Let them hear you. And we wait to see that green flag fly here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway for five and the conclusion. Down on the front stretch. 
here at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Grant Enfinger is your winner. 11 cautions in all. Let's hear it for Grant Enfinger, everybody. This was the fifth time that Grant made it to Las Vegas. Come on, Ryan, baby. He had one top five and three top ten finishes under his belt.